weeks ago. Um, and now I'm back with a new episode. Um, we're going to hop right in it. Um, I got some moves to make, you know what I mean? So that's why usually I'm in the car because I'm always, you know, doing what I got to do. You know what I mean? Um, so uh, today, let's see. Today, of course, we're going to read the Bible. And we got, let's see. Warrior of the Light by Paulo Coelho. And if you remember the episode that I had, it was um, The Alchemist. That's Paulo Coelho as well. Um, and he has a lot of books. This is more of like a spiritual book. Um, spiritual guide. Not I wouldn't say spiritual book. Just a guide that I guess helped him or people around him. So he wanted to give it to... Um, the masses and see if they like it you know and it's it's a very good book so i'm gonna read a couple pages out of that and of course i'm gonna read some scriptures um it's been a while since i've been on here and reading scriptures um so i'm back you know i hope everybody's been well uh like i always say all considering right now you know it's tough times we're going through right now but i hope everybody is um holding up doing well surviving, um, hustling, praying, and uh, everybody's safe. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna hop right into it. Today I want to go through a range of different things. Um, one, I have my first consultation paid. Uh, I told the gentleman um, I can do it for free, uh, but all I did was just give him some extra time, and um, yeah, it was good. It was a good feeling, uh, so I'm going to get into that. And first, I want to get into, I'm not really into politics, but I really have to speak on it because people might want my opinion, and this is my channel, so I want to give uh, my input on it. And to me, I've never voted, so all y'all liberals and whatever, oh, you're the reason uh, Trump's in there, whatever, I was the reason Bush was in there too, right, I was the reason Bush, Bush Sr. was in there too, right, I couldn't even vote back then, but I was the reason, right, so it's, it's whatever, man, you know what I mean, I'm, my president is God, and you know, and you ask some people, um, They'll ask you, oh, did, did you vote? Did you vote? Did you vote? No. Oh, man. You, man, you, you, your vote could have changed things. Your vote could have really... And you ask... You, you let them people finish. Okay, okay, yeah, yeah, okay. And you ask them, do you even believe in God? All right. Do you, do, do you believe... In, uh, reparations or you believe in slavery you know because at the end of the day you might think you're privileged but we all slaves yeah you know uh, we drive some people you know like me I drive Benzes drive farms whatever I live a decent good life and a lot of other people that might be millionaires billionaires but we all slaves man to the system and I never let that get out of my head that we're slaves to the system. Yeah, you want to do positive, think positive, and, you know, as a man thinketh, he is. So is he, you know what I mean? So that's the type of wavelength that I stay on. But if you really think this is a democracy that we're living in, you're the idiot, all right? <laughs> You are the idiot, because this, this is not a democracy, you know, um, and I don't try to get caught up in politics, man. I stay in my Bible, I stay prayed up, I stay fasting, and and that's, that's my true belief right there, you know what I mean? I don't believe in casting a vote, and if you look at it, the people, so-called people, uh, their vote didn't mean anything last time because 
Trump wasn't, uh, how can they say, he wasn't the, the popular vote. The Electoral College voted him in. And if you guys don't know who the Electoral College is, I suggest you do your research and stop pointing blame at people who don't want to get involved in the politics. Um, the Electoral College is probably, if I had to sum it up, you know, they try to word it, oh, this person, that person. But the Electoral College is, um, are the rich, the rich of the rich, um, you know, corporations and stuff like that. And their 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 only concern is who's going to help benefit them, at the end of the day, and keep the the bottom people, even millionaires, are bottom people, hundred millionaires, are bottom people. Um, who's going to keep them at bay and keep them slaves and stuff like that? Um, so it, it doesn't matter. You can own your own business. You're still a slave. You still have to get up. You still have bills to pay. You you still have to go out to these markets and, and get your food. You're still interacting in this world. You still need gas to get around. You still have a cell phone. You're still paying, paying heat. You're still uh, using hot water, cold water. It's like, you know what I mean? There's no getting out around it. Um, so you might as well you know, get used to it and, and, and stay prayed up and that's the way to go. And that's what I believe in. I've never voted. I've never, um, what do they call it? Jury duty. You know, uh, you know, never had to do that. Um, so I stay, my president is God. And, and that's what, that's the new wave that I'm on. That when people say, oh, did you vote? My president is God. And I just walk away. And keep them staring at my back as I walk away, you know. <laughs> and, and that's what that's what I'm on, man. I, like this, it doesn't matter what president is in there. Some and, and people got the nerve to say, "Oh, the lesser of two evils." Like, why would I want to participate? You you're already calling them evil, but the lesser of two evils. Why would? Why would anybody with a conscience or a soul or uh, a brain, for that matter, uh, participate? You know, and I'm not calling my people stupid or, you know, people who participate in that. That's just their routine of thinking things will change. And things haven't changed. You know, I'm 37, 38, 38 now. Um... And as far as I look back since I was 18, nothing has changed. Since 9-11, things have progressively, progressively gotten worse, more stricter, uh, less movement, uh, big brother, uh, more taxes, uh, less opportunities for people in urban environments, people with, uh, uh, you know, more debt you know, more, more death every year by year, more diseases, more, you know, nothing <laughs> like, you know what I mean? And when I lay that out, you can just either A, sit in the corner, cry about it, or B, get up, get on your grind, stay positive, and, and know the will of God, you know what I mean? And the angels will bless you if you stay righteous. And that's the path that I've been on. And that's what I'm going to continue on. You know what I mean? So let me move from that. You know what I mean? Hopefully I enlighten someone with that. Um, and if you want to continue to do that, I don't knock anybody. Continue going on with the routine. This year is going to be mail-in ballots. Go ahead. Do your thing. Uh, be mad at the person who gets in there. Oh, this person's been there four years. They didn't do nothing. You know, if the only way us as a people, I'm not even talking about doing riots, but us as a people, white, black, Latino, Asian, whatever you want to call it, if we're going to make a change, 
it's it's more of us than there are them. So everybody, the only way is everybody leave their business, quit their jobs, stop paying bills, and march to D.C. and stay there until they really do the will of the people. If people continue to feel that they're better than others, that they want to continue on and think this world is going to continue for years and years and years and years and, and, and without it crumbling and U.S. is going to be on top forever. It's, you know, if 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 the Lord hasn't showed you prophecies that are taking place you know me personally i feel bad for you you know what i mean um and you have to have spiritual lenses in order to see that and if you don't i'm just wasting my breath but hopefully i spark a seed that will um hopefully you can you know look into and uh get more information and that's why i'm here you know what i mean but uh, moving on, um, 